Hey! NES Evolution here. I like this now. Not being hold the camera. Got it kind of still. Kind of working some stuff out. Too bad that I'm going to be moving in a couple months and so this will all be changed. So hopefully all this scenery will be changed. I never did a game room tour. I guess I could do a quick one and show you this one and then once I get the other one all settled, uh, I'll be moving into, I'm living in an apartment right now. Actually, I'm moving into a condo. Yeah, condo. So what else? I'll have a basement, not just one game room. I have like a room. We have a two-bedroom apartment, and one of the rooms is my whole game room. Everything that is mine. Um, so yeah, this whole is funny because all this started a couple years ago. Um, so yeah, I started collecting games. Uh, and toys, once I, I kind of went through a divorce, well, I, not kind of, I did go through a divorce. Wah, wah, wah. It sucked. It was especially hard, especially hard on you when you're not the one that wanted one. But, so that sucks. But listen, there's a bright side. I'm doing good. Life is fine. Um, yeah, life's, life's good. I can't complain. I mean, yeah. So... But yeah, I started collecting all this stuff to kind of take my mind off all that. Um, I was getting into the YouTube people that do gaming on YouTube and retro gaming, you know, the Game Chasers, Pat the NES Punk, uh, Angry Video Game Nerd, all those people. And then with toys and stuff, I just got involved in it again. And it's great. It really took my mind off of it. I did this YouTube channel, started then. So I've had this YouTube channel around for a long time. I never had that many subs. I still don't. But I don't care because I like doing it. So let me get started on my video. Sorry, I don't know why I went on that mini rant. I told you guys. I don't know. I just kind of went a uh, pocket of air or something. <clears throat> but yeah, Troy Lions. But yeah, let me start because I've already taken way too long. Let me start with the most current game that I picked up. I went ahead and picked up Destiny. Uh, I got it for five bucks off this site off Facebook. So. I went ahead and picked it up. I played a couple times. Kind of a, to me, it's kind of a Halo ripoff. Whatever. Um, let's start with my N64 games. I think this brings up my total up to like close to 264 games that I have now. So I'm not very far away. I have this one's called um, Win Back. Army Men's. Sarge's Heroes 2, which this is a lot of fun. These Army Men games are a hoot, man. I like them a lot. Then I picked up a couple filler titles. Triple Play 2000. And Knockout Kings 2000. Someone put a nifty end label on there. So that's cool. Um, next up is my Sega Genesis games. I normally don't like to buy loose Sega Genesis games. But I did this time because I got a good deal on them. It was, I went to this place, was buy one, get one free. And somebody's messaging me. Sorry, my hand's in the way. I can't. When the message comes down, it bothers me. So I have to get rid of it. Oh, well. So I got uh, Alien Storm, which this is a really fun game. Uh, kind of labels a little rough. But yeah, I got this game free because I bought this game. Uh, General Chaos. I heard this is a lot of fun. So I picked that up. Um, it's a lot better shape. So yeah, I can't wait to play those. And up next is, I got a couple, I didn't get the games, which I already had the games. Um, but I went into the back room of this game store and saw a couple things that I wanted. Picked them up and he said, yeah, you sell them to me. I got the box for Mission Impossible. Not in bad shape. Very good shape. It's funny how these boxes have survived from the 80s and early 90s. This is the box that I'm very happy about. Castlevania. Three, Dracula's Curse. This box is not cheap. I mean, if you get this with the game, the box, and a manual, it can go for, I think it can go for like probably a hundred or so. So yeah, I'm very happy. It's got a little thing right here, but no tears, no rips. The bottom's awesome. I mean, look at that. I mean, it's in really good shape. I ended up paying, I think, 10 bucks for this box. Both got both boxes for 15 so went ahead and uh, got that. All I need is the manual for that Draculas. So, okay, now the last thing here, something I got with credit. 
Something I've been debating about getting, because I like to play all my games on the normal consoles, the original systems, because that's the way that I like to do it. But with a, this one having HDMI and all the systems on it, I thought I went ahead and got it. Charged me eighty dollars, so I went ahead and got a Retron Five. Ha <laughs> ha. So yeah, this plays Genesis, Genesis, Super Nintendo, Nintendo, and Famicom, and then uh, it also will play Sega Master System games with an adapter, uh, the Master System adapter. Also, it also plays Game Boy Advanced and Game Boy games right there. So I have yet to hook this up. I don't even know if I'll hook it up until my new place. But the cool thing is you can hook it up and play it on a flat screen TV. You cannot play it on an SRT t or uh, what do they call that? The you know the tube TVs, the ones that, that t the one I play all my old school games on, because I feel like the old school games look the best on an old school TV. But with this, oh, and the cool thing about it is they have the plugins. So you got Super Nintendo there. I guess I just watch myself on the screen, but it's it's I can't. Oh man, I never was good at puzzles. Ha <laughs> ha. Um. And you got a good old NES and Sega Genesis. So you can use your old school controllers if you don't want to use the new one. And the other side for two player. Um, the controller, which I'll show you, is kind of garbage. I don't like it. I don't like the feel. I don't like the design at all. And listen, here. It's like a tape ready. I don't like it. Yeah, I don't like it at all. So, I mean, I'll give it a try, but I'm not sure if I like all that noise. I'm gaming! So, yeah. So, yeah. I mean, I'll probably just use the retro controllers because that's where it's at. So, yeah. And yes, sorry I ranted off at the beginning, but NES Evolution signing off will be like my retro, my games that I got and everything. And third video tonight. I probably won't upload this till tomorrow though, so that's good. I'll give you guys a day to watch stuff. So NES Evolution signing off. Can't wait for my Detroit Lions. And I will talk to you later, people. Bye!